हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू कैटलिस्ट केमिस्ट्री यूट्यूब चैनल एज वी डिस्कस द लास्ट क्लास नेचर ऑफ कार्बन हेलोजन बॉन्ड नेचर ऑफ कार्बन हेलोजन बॉन्ड कार्बन एंड हेलोजन आर वेयर आउट ऑफ दिस टू विच इज मोर इलेक्ट्रो नेगेटिविटी हेलोजन इज अ मोर इलेक्ट्रो नेगेटिविटी दैट्स वाई द इलेक्ट्रॉन मूव फ्रॉम कार्बन टू हेलोजन नॉट मूव फ्रॉम हेलोजन टू कार्बन वेर देर इज अ मोर इलेक्ट्रो नेगेटिविटी एटम इज देयर ऑब्वियसली द इलेक्ट्रॉन टू अट्रैक्ट टूवर्ड्स इट्स that is most important that's why in this case where there is a carbon halogen bond is there obviously minus i effect takes place minus i means what inductive effect inductive effect is usually divided into two types one is positive inductive effect another one is what negative inductive effect positive inductive effect means what electron donating group attached to the carbon that is indicate what positive inductive group but in negative inductive group means what there is a, there is a electron withdrawing group obviously all the halogens are what fluorine chlorine bromine iodine are what electron withdrawing group okay that's why in this case what minus i effect takes place next after that uh, we have, as we discussed means uh, the most important point is what dipole moment the dipole moment is represented by what d by the how are going to find out the dipole moment the mu is equal to q into d mu means what in this case uh, that is called what dipole moment uh, dipole moment it is the product of what charge and distance between them that is called what dipole moment after that you know very well about that bond length and bond energy of some of the haloalkanes today we are going to discuss the continue part of haloalkanes and haloarenes methods of preparation of what haloalkanes in this case what our aim is what we are going to prepare prepare what haloalkanes our aim is what we are going to prepare haloalkanes with the help of what the first point is what from alcohols alcohols means which group oh group obviously oh group with the help of the alcohols we are going to prepare haloalkanes in this case from alcohol using phosphorus halides using what phosphorus halides phosphorus it will come under what p block elements okay example these three are indicate what general examples are there the first one roh is indicate what alcohol just here i am going to write here roh what is the name of this one roh is indicate what in this case what roh is what alcohol alcohol can react with what phosphorus pentachloride how are going to read this one phosphorus pentachloride this is what phosphorus penta penta means what five phosphorus pentachloride phosphorus pentachloride alcohol can react with phosphorus pentachloride there is a formation of what alkyl halide what is the name of this one alkyl halide general name alkyl halide after that this co pocl3 pocl3 is phosphorus oxy trichloride or generally you can call phosphorus oxy chloride pocl3 how are going to call phosphorus oxy chloride plus release of what hcl this is the what first one general reaction for what preparation of what haloalkane just see here our aim is what method of preparation of haloalkanes in this case what preparation of what haloalkanes takes place with the help of what alcohol as well as what phosphorus halide with the help of these two there is a formation of what haloalkanes this alkyl halide is a general name haloalkanes is a what ifac nomenclature next second general example is what three moles just this three don't worry about this three this is a balancing the reaction you have to take alcohol alcohol can react with what phosphorus tribromide pbr3 this is phosphorus pentachloride pcl5 in this case what bromine is there in this case what chlorine is there that's why in this case just see here they are going to just make the balancing the reaction that's why they are going to take a three moles and this alcohol can react with the phosphorus tribromide you have to write this is alcohol this is phosphorus tribromide there is a formation of what alkyl halide general name is what alkyl halide particularly means what in this case alkyl bromide you can call otherwise bromo alkanes you can you can call no problem there is a, uh, plus the release of what s3po4 what is the name of this one ortho phosphorus acid ortho phosphorus ortho phosphorus acid s3po3 huh? oxidation state what is oxidation state this is this point is what extra just i am going to solve here s3po3 is there 
uh, we need what what is oxidation state of phosphorus so just we have to calculate what is the general oxidation state of hydrogen is plus 1 3 into 1 3 plus we do not know phosphorus oxidation take as a x what is the general oxidation state of oxygen minus 2 3 to the 6 is equal to 0 just here in this case 6 minus 3 we are going to get a 3 what is oxidation state of phosphorus is plus 3 in this case particularly for what orthophosphorus just here orthophosphoric is different orthophosphorus is different orthophosphoric means the oxidation state is plus 4 for phosphorus just here in this case important point is what OUS most important bear in mind OUS means what lower oxidation state just I am going to take another example that is S3PO4 what is the name of this one orthophosphoric just see here orthophosphoric orthophosphoric acid this one is indicate what orthophosphoric acid just see here in this case what IC acid this is IC, IC means what higher oxidation state you have to find out the oxidation state of what phosphorus just here hydrogen 3 into 1 3 we do not know what is oxidation state of phosphorus you have to take x after that what general oxidation state of oxygen is minus 2 4 to za 8 equal to 0 8 minus 3 we are going to get a x equal to what 4 4 to za 8 in this case what is oxidation state you have to find out in this case we are going to get a what 5 oxidation state of this is we indicate what 5 4 to the 8 no S3 PO4 this is indicate what orthophosphoric orthophosphoric IC acids are there means higher oxidation state OUS acids are there that is called what lower oxidation state ok bear in mind important this is orthophosphoric this is called orthophosphorus ok next after that uh, third point uh, this is what starting material is alcohol this can react with what phosphorus triiodide pi3 iodine is represented by what capital i phosphorus triiodide this is phosphorus tribromide there is a formation of product is what alkyl halide you have to write alkyl halide otherwise you have to write alkyl iodide no problem again there is a release of what orthophosphoric acid same what is the oxidation state of orthophosphoric acid in this case what plus 3 oxidation state very simple 3 to the 6 6 minus 3 we are going to get a 3 ok Th these are what general example uh, of from alcohols using a phosphorus halide these are the general example ok next point we are going to discuss particular example particular example for what phosphorus halide <coughs> particular example exact using same phosphorus halide only using using what phosphorus halide only using phosphorus halides ok just I am going to take a particular different example this is what CS3 next one CH2 OH what is the name of this one this is called what ethanol particular IPC name for this one is what ethanol is a IPC name ok. Uh, CS3, CH2, OH otherwise you have to call alcohol in generally ethyl alcohol is a common name ethanol is a what I patient nomenclature after that this can react with uh, just I am going to change the heading here particularly particularly what preparation of alkyl chlorides you have to add that heading that is better just here preparation preparation of alkyl chloride particularly our aim is what preparation of what chloride alkyl chloride that is why in this case ethanol can react with what PCL5 ethanol can react with what PCL5 what is the product very simple just here you have to remove the OH attached with what Cl final product is what CS3 CH2 Cl what is the release, uh, release in this case just here POCl3 POCl3 you have to count 3 plus 1 4 H 4 Cl are there but actually how many Cl's are Cl are there reactant side 5 Cl the release of what HCl this is a general example what is the name of this one the name of this one is chloroethane otherwise you have to call alkyl chloride both are same chloroethane is a particular IPC nomenclature common name is what 
alkyl chloride is a common name. This is the one example for what preparation of alkyl chlorides. The next example is preparation of what alkyl bromide and the next example is what preparation of alkyl iodide. Just here I, I am going to tell you very simple trick is there. In this case PCl5 how we are going to attach with what alcohol. You, you have to count how many chlorines are there this side reactant side 5 chlorine. In this case how many chlorines are there 5 chlorine only 3 plus 1 4 plus 1 5. Totally how many chlorines are there 5 chlorine. How many phosphorus are there 1 phosphorus how many phosphorus 1 phosphorus how many oxygen 1 oxygen in this case what 1 oxygen this is a what a balanced reaction. Just see here I am going to take same just I will tell you trick what is how we are going to remember this one CH2 is there after that this is O is there next this is what H is there. Okay. Uh, we have what FeCl5 is there just here in this case I am going to make it a mark like this I am going to write Cl here 1 Cl I am going to write after that just I am going to make a mark like this in this case I am going to write a PCl3 finally only one HCl is left no. Uh, sorry only one Cl is left now that Cl I am going to write here just see here just you have to add all these three CS3, CH2, CL just see here CS3, CH2, CL no problem. After that PCL3 O is there now you have to write correct form PO Cl3, PO Cl3 after that one hydrogen one Cl finally we are going to get a Hydro, uh, HCl okay the hydrochloric acid okay this is the water trick this is a very simple trick with the help of this one you have to write remaining okay next I am going to uh, give only one example for what alkyl chloride if you want more example just you have to change the number of uh, carbon atoms number of carbon atoms in this case two are there better you have to take three four or you have to take one no problem okay next after that the next one is what just here I am going to write here only the next concept is what preparation just I am going to remove the here preparation no problem preparation of alkyl bromide preparation of what alkyl bromide ok. In this case what our aim is what bromine preparation of what alkyl bromide I am going to write example here only better ok just see here. CH3, CH3 I am going to write here only, okay, it, I think it is not visible, just here CS3 is there, after that CH2 is there, next one is what OH, is it right, okay, next after that this can react with what PBR3. PBR3 okay you know very well about that general reaction in general reaction I am going to take a 3 moles this is what 3 moles because of make it balance finally there is a formation of product is also same this is what C CS3 CH2 next one is what BR plus release of you have to count uh, how many BR are there in this case 3 BR in this case what 3 BR matter is closed finally in this case just here how many hydrogens are there 3 hydrogen how many oxygens are there 3 oxygen after that finally there is a formation of product is what s 3 po 3 ortho phosphorus acid what is oxidation state of phosphorus in this case particularly what plus 3 oxidation state ok bear in mind what is the IPC nomenclature of this one chloroethane is here is there in this case you have to write bromoethane bromoethane is a IPC name bromoethane ok this is the what second example what preparation of alkyl bromide next the last one is what preparation of alkyl iodide same simple ok alkyl iodide preparation of what alkyl iodide alkyl iodide ok what is the starting material for alkyl iodide same you have to take 3 moles only you have to take 3 for bromine and iodine because of make it balance that is it ok. This is called what CH3 next one is what CH2 OH is there this can react with what Pi3 there is a formation of product is what same 3 moles of what CS3 CH2 I plus release of what S3 PO3 what is the IPC name of this one Idoethane. Ido Ethane is a IPC nomenclature for what this one common name is what alkyl iodide is a common name 
okay this is the what last example for in this case preparation of what alkyl halides this is the last one is preparation of alkyl halide you have to check uh, completely what balance the reaction how many iodines are there three iodine just here in this case what three iodine in this case uh, you know very little about that phosphorus is usually divided into three types one is white phosphorus black phosphorus red phosphorus are there but in this case particularly they are going to ask you pi3 pbr3 this is indicate what red phosphorus when bromine can uh, pass with what red phosphorus there is a formation of what pbr3 next this is a red phosphorus can pass with what iodine you are going to get a pi3 bear in mind important these two are indicate what red phosphorus okay uh, these two are indicate what red phosphorus uh, this white phosphorus what is the property of white phosphorus red phosphorus black phosphorus we are going to study in a p block elements okay friends Thank you.